Hey, everybody. No one yet. I'm Laura. This is Jewelry, etc. Um, I'm kind of doing this on whim, but I got, got new sterling inventory, which is, it's crazy good, you guys. It's so good. It's so good. I did pick out a set of earrings that I'm keeping for myself, and I did pull one ring out so far that I'm obsessed with. I freaking love it. Um, I'm debating on keeping it, but I won't. I'll put it up for sale first, but um, yeah. So uh, we are going to look at all those things. I'm going to pull all of these things out, show all of you. And if you see something you like, first dibs will be to whoever's in the chat right now. Well, no one's here now, but you know, who will be in the chat. And then following that, you'll have to leave a comment if you want something. Um, and then going forward, when these get shown during a show, the price is going to be a bidded price. So today these are going to be buy now prices. Um, you can wait and see if you can get it for a better deal during an auction, or if you want first dibs, just comment and uh, you shall get them. Um, you can email me too. It's going to be kind of like a first comes first serve thing. And if you haven't purchased from me before, please send me an email. I absolutely despise, I'm just going to say it, I despise trying to find people <laughs> that want to order stuff. It drives me crazy. They'll leave a comment, but they've never ordered before. They don't send me their info. I have no way to comment, like to contact them unless I leave a comment for them. Um, yeah. Hey, Bonnie. Oh, thanks for stopping in and saying hello. I am well. I'm busy as usual, but I'm good. Um, anywho, so yeah, long story short, just email me if you've never purchased before. It's on the screen, but it's jewelryetcchannel at gmail.com. Make sure you got all the double letters in there. I thought I heard noise. My uh, kids are napping, so this may end up being like a kind of, I have to run really quick kind of thing if the kids wake up. Um, so just heads up on that. <laughs> but at least I'm here today, right? All right, so here's the other thing. My nails are atrocious. I know. I pulled the, uh, well, not pulled, but, you know, got the um, fakies off. And I've just been giving my nails a rest. And they're just short and ugly. And this is the way God made me. Ugly hands. They function great, though, which is wonderful. But uh, my nails are ugly. So, sorry. Sorry about the ugly nails. It's just the way life is. But anywho, hopefully I'll be putting some pretty ones back on here soon. But, you know, time. It might be a quick, it might be indeed. That's life, right? Life with kids, it's unpredictable. You know. All right, plus I got one working on homework right now. So if he needs help. Oh, man, these are so good. You know what? I think I might need to plug this light in so you guys can see better. Look at that. I don't know if you can tell, but I do believe those are aquas in there. I think they're CZs, but the stones are, the ones in the middle are aquas. They're very light, like a very kind of just tinted uh, blue color. It's so gorgeous. Dang, I'm so happy with this new supplier. I love everything I've gotten from them. They've been exceptional. Oh, they're, oh, thank you, Bonnie. I appreciate you saying that, but I'm so self-conscious over them. But hey, it is what it is. Um, let me plug, let me get my light, this guy plugged in really quick if I can. At some point I might have to lose the light and then gain my phone charger. I only have one charger in here. Let's see. Do, 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 do. Let's get this thing powered on. Ha ha. All right. And then... my Where are you, Mandrel? Are you hiding in here? All right, I don't know where my Mandrel is. What's the problem? Ha! Problem no more. Here it is. All right, no worries, Bonnie. Thank you for coming in. I appreciate it. All right, so this is a size seven. This one is going to be, if you want it again, comment. Next time this comes up, it will be a bidded item. But we'll do 35 on this one. This is sterling. These are brand new, by the way. Brand new inventory, new, never worn. So the metal's in really good shape. And they're just super duper pretty. I just love it. 
All right, so that one's going to be 35. Let me move this aside. We'll just pull these out. Oh, I'm going to do my favorite, the one I want to keep. Hello, Darcy. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. All right, this one right off the bat, I'm going to tell you this is going to be, I'm going to do $48 buy it now on this. I'm obsessed. This is Rotolite Garnet. It's so, so, so gorgeous. They look like little like lavender flowers wrapped around your finger. This one is sitting at about like eight and a quarter. We'll call it eight and a quarter. But it's so gorgeous. I, I'm obsessed with this one. It just it's really comfortable on. This is the only one I've tried on. Let's see, can I fit it there? Aha. There. It has good coverage. You know what I mean? It's like almost knuckle to knuckle. It's just gorgeous. I love this one. I love the way the light um, hits the uh, hits the stones. There's the inside of it. It's pretty smooth. All the metal work is very, very smooth. Split shank. The design is just stunning. I love it. All right, so that one's going to be 48. If anybody wants that one. And these will come up for auction sometime in the near future-ish. I just don't know when exactly. That's life, right? I just don't know when everything is happening. I know I used to be super regular. I used to be very on top of things, but things are crazy right now. My studio is hard to access because we have someone in the basement who's um, living with us temporarily. <clears throat> Excuse me. My mother-in-law is going through her chemo now, and she's the one who's been giving me breaks during the week to watch the kids so I could like focus on this Let's focus on my channel she's not available so it's just you know we just we're just like spread pretty thin right now I guess you could say all right here we go this is tanzanite and opal how sweet is this thing I think this one's on the smaller side this one's a six for my smaller fingered ladies but that is an opal an Ethiopian opal and trillion cut tanzanites on either side. Size six and some change. This one will do, I'm gonna say 25 on this. 25 and it's, it's very, very pretty. And if you get direct light on there, whew, it's gorgeous. Actually, maybe I can, let me go grab my flashlight. I'll be right back since, uh, hopefully you guys don't mind. I'll be right back, I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. I'm coming back in a second. <clears throat> I'm sure you hear me. Okay. Sure, blammo. I haven't gotten to do this yet. Well, let's not do the strobe light, huh? Oh, come on, flashlight. It's... It's trying to do the strobe light thing on me. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, there, now you can see kind of the red fire coming through, hopefully. I can see it in front of me. I don't know if the camera's picking it up though. Yeah, a little bit, see? See? So you take that away. You get this in that like direct hand lights and it shows up really, really pretty. All right, so that one's 25. Yay, Bonnie's back. Welcome. Oh, you know what? I meant to tag these two for their sizes and stuff. Ah, oh, whatever. Whatever. I'll just have to do it again next time I show it. But I kind of think it's nice seeing the size as you're being shown it and not just seeing it on the tag. I don't know why. I just personally like to see, see it on a mandrel just for myself. You know what I'm saying? Bonnie, you got it. All right, let me write it down. Thank you. First purchase in weeks. I haven't been on i haven't done a show here i don't think in some time i was on krista d's channel patricia welcome in all right let me i'm gonna tag this one since you bought it and then we'll know that it's yours so i don't mess that one up thank you my dear and i guess i'll put a z on there just to because Bonnie Yoder does buy from me every now and again. I don't want to confuse you all. All right. Let's get that bad boy on there. It is officially yours. Thank you. And then I dropped it. I dropped it while I tried to tag it. 
How are you doing, Bonnie? How's everybody? How are you doing, Darcy? And how are you, Patricia? Yeah, that's a good Ethiopian opal ain't cheap either. But if I can get a good price, I like to give good prices, you know what I mean? All right, where I was in the process of opening one. Here it is. Oh, oh my God, I haven't seen this one up close yet. I think this is another aqua. It's, I think, CZ. Oh no, this one's Rotolite. Oh, it's Rotolite. <sighs> Rotolite aqua. If you guys like some pretty cocktail rings, doing okay. All right, I'll we'll take okay better than bad, right? Oh my gosh, you guys. Look at that stunner. Who? Nor the cellophane. Oh wow, this one's a bigger one. This must be like an eight. Holy moly. All right, talk about knuckle to knuckle. There it is right there. So this is aqua, oval cut aquas, and then there's little accents of rotolite garnets. Oh, yay. I'm glad you got to catch me live. Look how freaking pretty this is. Oh, gosh. All right, so the inside, let me see what size this is. Usually that finger is about an eight. Let's see what this one's. Yep, see? convenient knowing all the sizes of your fingers so if you don't have your mandrel you can still make a good educated guess that is good that is really really good i'm going to say 45 on this one 45 it's domed out a little bit so the thing i like about that is sometimes if you have knuckles that are a little thicker like you're an eight down here but sometimes you can finagle it over the knuckle and still be okay if that makes sense that is pretty, super pretty. Whoa. All right, so 45 on him. I think he was 45, he was 48, and I already forget what that one was. All right, at least I said it in the video. <clears throat> Elizabeth! Hey. Is this Elizabeth? I haven't been around for a while. Lost track of who's who. Am I Elizabeth? I'm Laura. Elizabeth is Elizabeth. Everybody's got their names here, right? Maybe. Oh, not Elizabeth K. Okay, I see the confusion. How's your knee doing? You know I always have to ask. I miss you, Elizabeth, and Bonnie for that matter. I miss all you guys. Hanging out. I've just been super duper unable to do what I usually do. And now I'm trying to incorporate my farm channel back into my life just because I've been so preoccupied with farm stuff that it just feels kind of natural to go that route, if that makes sense. All right, here we go. More opals, y'all. These are CZs and black Ethiopian opals. Ooh. Well, let me get the flashlight. This one's going to be a flasher for sure. This is a size, size nine. This one's so gorgeous. <laughs> Let's go, we'll go 30 on this one. Yay, thank you. Thank you for subbing to it. It's foul mouths, if anybody else is curious or interested. Look at that bad boy. Oh my goodness. Those are faceted too, by the by, if you can't tell. Awesome, and the C's, these are so sparkly, wow. So those things are like rival diamonds right there with their sparkle. That was that was some good sparkling. All right, beautiful. Again, size nine, Ethiopian opal and CZ. Um, God, that's pretty. Thirty, I think we said on that one. All right, I have I have a, a set here, so let me see if I can find all of it. I do believe these are chrome, Mama G. If you see something and you like it, I'm throwing out buy it now prices. So they are, these are buy it now prices right now. If they come up in the future, they'll be bidded though. But for right now, they're buy it now. And I'm just going until my kids wake up basically. In a nutshell. Yeah, if you see something, you'll have to remind me how much it was. <laughs> All right, so this I do believe is, no, these are, this is green tourmaline, I think. It looks like chrome though. 
I'll have to go back and check, but I do know that it's a natural stone and I do believe that those are uh, CZs and everything is in sterling. This chain, I do believe is nine uh, inches on the drop. So 18 total, but this is part of a set. So I'm just showing you this for one hot second. Actually, where's my neck? Where's my neck? Let's throw this one up in the background for now. Can y'all hear me okay too? Okay, cool. We'll drop that there for a moment. I think there's a matching ring. It's either ring or earring. I can't remember now. Most of what I got were rings because I'm obsessed with rings. And this, this is something else, y'all. I'm trying to kind of ease into selling exactly what I want to sell. From the very beginning, I've wanted to sell fine jewelry and especially faceted gemstones in sterling and gold. And so I'm kind of moving in that direction um i do like the other like the semi-precious stones that are more like not fancy cut not uh faceted and things like that so i'll still be having those too but this is like this is what makes my heart sing i love it i love it very very much all right these are tourmaline oh this is the same design as this one it looks like these ones are opal this is tourmaline so we have kind of like a root beer color one up in the upper left we've got a dark pink and a lighter pink lighter green darker green and then an almost clear one topaz comes in every color under the sun okay awesome thank you this one's sitting at about seven and three quarters and it's beautiful we'll do this one at 30 also i think the other one was also 30. so 30 on that one if anybody wants it I know, Elizabeth, but I'll tell you a secret. I don't know when it's going to happen, but I will be having an encore rock show at some point. I just don't know when. I don't have enough inventory, but I'm collecting inventory here and there. When I have enough, I'll have a show, an encore show. So you can look forward to that at some point in time. <coughs> you too, Bonnie. I do have, I have a handful of towers here right now. What, there's Valorite. I feel like you guys probably already have it, but I can throw some on the table if you really want to see. Probably, in the, yeah, maybe in the winter. I will. I'll make sure you know. All right, come on. Okay, there we go. There we go. This is the weird thing, though. They keep, they package the earrings together in a plastic bag, but then one goes in this bag and the other one is loose. I guess they don't want them hidden against each other, but I don't know if that's really a big deal. These are aqua and sapphire in sterling. Um, let's do, <laughs> so you said send up a flare. We'll send out a call to you. I guess I could send a flare. You might be able to see it from there. I don't know. Uh, let's do, we'll do 35 on these. So this is aqua marine in those and then green and yellow sapphires. And then these are these um, bags. You kind of have to like lift on the prong a little bit. It's like a tension setting kind of thing. And then it clicks into place. Really pretty. I already forget what I said. Did I say 35 on these? Look at that. God, they're so good. The clarity on those aqua are really, really good. And they do, they're not like ultra saturated blue because if they were, they would be way more expensive. But they definitely have a blue tint. Like you can tell they're like a pastel blue if you can, or if you will. But they're uh, very clear. Very clear. Very clear and very pretty. Oh, I like them. All right. I must not be used to talking because my my throat is drying out. Sorry, I thought I heard yelling, but it's just my son whistling. <laughs> no, not your internet. I hope it's you and not me. Why is that? Did you have a storm or something? Hmm, that's a bummer. All right, here we go. Here, oh, this is a fun one. This is different. Now this is, I believe this is Appetite. Oh, I 
think it's appetite tanzanite if I remember correctly. <clears throat> to get water. This is a larger one. This was sitting at a 10 and a quarter about. And it's like abstract. This is not a symmetrical design at all. It's like kind of a scattered. <laughs> Can you guys hear my son whistling? A scattered uh, stone thing. I do believe this is appetite. The blue is appetite in the. You guys may have seen appetite in a stone. It's way like very opaque when you have it in a stone, but you can find these clear deposits of it that they clean up and facet, and they're just such a cool color. The neon blue appetite is super bright. Actually, do I have some of that? I can't remember if I ordered it or not. Um, anywho, so this is like I said on the larger side, ten and a quarter. Let's do. We'll do thirty on this one as well. Lots of gemstones in there, you guys. It's pretty. That's the thing. No storm. Internet, phone, and cable go out for 24 hours, then the power for two days. Power comes back, but no cable, phone, or internet until late last night. Ugh. No me gusta. I don't like not having internet. <laughs> it makes me feel uncomfortable. I miss everything. All right, I'm just going to say it. I'm addicted to the internet. I already know that. I get it. But I am. But I'll tell you what, our internet went out. We had a storm here a few days ago last week. And man, I really got some cleaning done in my house. <laughs> That's something else too, you guys. Oh my gosh, I didn't even tell you that. So <clears throat> if, you, if you're familiar with the channel, if you guys know me, you know that I operate out of my basement most of the time. Um, we've moved everything around so that we have, we cleared out one of the bedrooms upstairs so that I could turn it into a studio. And I'm so jazzed about that. All right, so this is emerald, opal, cubic zirconia. Awesome, pretty. Oh, it's a smaller one. What are you, six? Six and some change. God, it's so gorgeous, though. That opal. I'm going to wake my kids up with my enthusiasm. <gasps> Look at it. Look at the fire in there. Can you see that? Oh, I hope that's translating. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Look at the freaking highlights in that stone. That's pretty. That is pretty. Let's let's do this one. Let's say 38 on him. Ah, God, I feel like that's too cheap, but I'll just I'll just stick it with that for now. This is your first dibs. This is I'll probably start it higher for a bid next time I have it out. It's just it's a really good opal. Ethiopian opal, and those are real emeralds. It's pretty. Okay. It's really, really pretty. That's a good one. That's a good one. All right. What else have we got? <clears throat> oh my gosh. I'm going to have to get, I'm going to have to run and get water at some point in time. Thank you, Darcy. I think so too. That's a really nice stone. Get this out of the way. Okay. What else we got? Uh, I know. You know what? I'll tell you what, Elizabeth. It pays to live near a prison. <laughs> if you have a prison nearby. And uh, I think they, like, make an effort to get the power on quickly so that, you know, I think we're, we must be, like, on their same line or something because we always get power on fairly fast. Like, we had a winter storm. Um, oh, these match this ring. Ooh. All right, these are another ones that kind of have that tension prong thing going on. So you do have to kind of like push this prong. Oh, no, up, not down. Up a little bit. And then it snaps on. Ready? Oh, it didn't do the, it didn't do the click. It didn't do the click. Do the click. Maybe I pressed down too much on it. Or up too much, I mean, I don't know. Can we hear the click, please? Oh, there it goes. A little snap. Anywho, these ones match the other one. Uh, we'll say, we'll say thirty on these. These match those. Match that ring. Thirty on those ones. <laughs> I know, right? I want to keep everything, especially that one. That one I love. Anywho, so the power of the storm. What a bad winter storm, and it knocked our power out. I think we're out for like. I don't, I don't even know if it was eight hours. It had to have been less than that. It wasn't that long, all things considered. My husband's shop, which is closer to the city, 
was out for the entire week. Uh, I'm very happy that we had it on at our house. That was pretty cool. But I felt bad for my husband. They couldn't get anything done. You can't work without electricity. Like, basically in any job. All right. This is a sweet, pretty little ring. This one is $9. Or $9. <laughs> it is not that. Size 9. But we'll do a good price on this. We'll just do this one at a mere 15 bucks for Ethiopian opal. And I don't know what the black is. Maybe a spinel? I can go and check my receipt so I can give you a better idea of what's on it, but there we go. 15 bucks for this one right now. Oh, I think it's sapphire. Look, it's blue. Those are sapphires. It's not black. There are little blue sapphires in there. And the sweet little, little pear. Look, just a sweet little ring. Not ostentatious like some of these other ones. Exhibit A. Except that it's awesome. There we go. So 15 for the sweet little one. Let's put that one over yonder. Let's keep going. Here's some more appetite. Last one we had that was really big. We were out for two days and it was during one of the heat waves. Ugh, that happened to us, uh, was it last year? Last year or the year before, we had to buy a wall unit. I know, right? Generic might not be a bad idea. If you can afford it, you might as well. It's not a bad thing to have. Look how pretty. This is Appetite, y'all. This is gem quality Appetite. It's very, 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 very pretty. This one is a size just shy of an eight. Just shy of an eight. Look at all the scents. Let's see. One, two, three. There's six stones in there. This is so darn cute and pretty right here. This one, let's say, what is it? A size eight. So fit that finger. Um, gosh. I don't even know. I don't know. What to, we'll say, we'll say 28 on this one. $28 on the appetite ring. This is, I'll tell you what I like about this. Because I go like this and it looks like I have a full band of appetite, but it's just a comfortable silver ring underneath. So you can wear it with comfort without having, because when these things, these giant, sorry about that, these giant like stones are all the way around for infinity, it like knocks against your finger. To me, it's just annoying. It's not like super uncomfortable. It's just, it's just annoying. I prefer, I prefer that. I do for the bigger stones. For smaller stones, I like a good infinity band, but that's cute. That's cute. I do, Darcy. That's what these ones are. These ones here are pierced. And then those are opals. Ethiop black Ethiopian opal. And then I have these ones. Which are uh, aqua and sapphires. And then I got to figure out if I have more. I thought I had one more pair. Let me look at my bag of tricks here. Yes, there's one more. Let me grab these really quick. Grab these earrings. These are a little different. These are post backs, like with the butterfly backing. All the rich people have the Generac. Well, can't blame them. It's brilliant. It's a good idea. I know, right? Hey, if you rob a bank, you know, let me get in on that. Not any of the work. I just want the proceeds. <laughs> All right. Okay, so these are more opal. This is, oh shoot, is that? They're probably green sapphire, but I can't remember for the life of me off the top of my head right now what those stones are. But I think they're green sapphires and uh, opal. Let me get, and it's like a cool little cognac kind of color to it. All right, let me get my, my flasheroony here. All right, so these are teardrop shape. And hopefully, I know that things go a little crazy on this camera sometimes with this, uh, this, um, oh gosh, what do you call it, flashlight? All right, those are super sweet. We'll say 28 on these. 
I'm dibbing the appetite. I know the appetite ring is awesome. Rose Hawk, welcome in. We still got a few pretties left. All right, so what did I just say? 25, I think, for those ones. I am so happy. Like, if no one buys any of them, lucky me. Oh, where am I? <clears throat> okay, so th that's that's the last of them. Those are the last of the earrings. Uh, dainty I, is not always something I have. I hate to tell you because I like my stones, so I get the stones a little larger. Fun surprises! It's a surprise to see you! Welcome in. Oh my goodness, this one is taped shut. Why would they do that? Isn't the Ziploc baggy thing enough? Do they have to tape it too? All right, we've got a citrine here. Citrine, and again, probably CZs. They work with CZs and little sapphires a lot. This is kind of a nice little, more on the dainty side ring. And again, everything you see is, is uh, sterling. Patty, how are you? Oh, I see the ring, the ring that matches that necklace over there. Get out of here. That's pretty. All right, let's do, we'll say 20 on this one. $7 for that citrine, not seven. I'm sorry, I keep doing that. $20, size seven, citrine, cubic zirconia, um, halo, and beautiful. What else can I say? I love you for infinity. I mean, I want the appetite. Oh, you want it. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were, I thought you said you were digging it. I don't remember how much it was. Do you remember what I said? That's a pretty one. Remind. Oh, I didn't even write down the price on the last one either. I'll have to go back and look. I already forget. If you remember the price on these two, let me know. <laughs> so I can write it down. Not be a, a horrible salesperson like I usually am. All right, 28 on that one. Do you remember the other one? I can go back and watch. All right. I just don't, I have poor memory. There's a lot of rings up here. This is why I should have tagged everything as I was going. And I never do that. Perla, how are you? How's it going? Man, lots of fun faces in here today. Thank you everybody for coming in. Oh, hit the thumb. I gotta always remind people, right? Hit the thumbs up if you don't mind. All right, Bonnie, if you remember what this one is, let me know. Otherwise, I'll go back and watch. Unless that one is 28 and the other one, I don't remember the price of that one. Oh, let's put that green one out. Let's do it. Let's do it, do it, do it. I know, I can't remember. <laughs> this, is, this is not going to work. I need to tag these things as I go. I'm just going to have to go back and, and watch. There's nothing else to it. All right, here we go. So this is, we got it. This is, uh, I really want to say it's green tourmaline, but man, does it look like a chrome diopside. It's that color, but I believe these were tourmalines. This one is a set of seven. So this one's going to be sold as a set because they're perfect matches with each other. All right. And if no one buys them, maybe we'll split them up for later but for now if you want the set of these two i'll do i'll do uh 45 for the set 45 for the set size and ring all these beautiful cz accents and then the matching pendant that's so pretty i really like the the way they put the little stones into the like up here, kind of in the bale, not quite. The bale's up here, but leading up to it. And then the chain they chose is perfect. It's beautiful. This is a Singapore chain. I just got distracted by a chicken out my window. There's a chicken running around out there. Can you see? You probably can't see. Every once in a while, you'll you'll catch something running by back here. Those, those are the chickens. <laughs> Hopefully, they're the chickens. All right, and then we have... Oh, this one. This is Morganite, y'all. Okay, Appetite was 28. Okay, if you remember the other one, let me know. Um, like I said, otherwise I'll just have to 
dang it, I just flung it across the dang room. All right, hold on. Uncommitted. I've officially crawled on my hands and knees to retrieve something. Woo! There goes that. All right, here we go. So this one is Morganite. If you guys don't know, Morganite is in the barrel family right there with uh, Emerald and Aqua. Look at that. It's so pretty. So this is just like a pale blush pink. The more saturated ones go for crazy amounts of money. This one, not quite as saturated, but definitely has a little blushiness to it. Size seven. Yes. Yes, Perla. That is my name. <laughs> What's up? All right, this one's size seven. Let's do, let's do 38 on this. 38 for this one. Gorgeous. I don't know. I might do what not show with these pieces, honestly. If they don't sell here first, though, I just like to give all the YouTube people first dibs on things, you know. I guess I should. I just I prefer to do it on YouTube if I can for multiple reasons. One, because there's a lot of people here that I like. <laughs> Two, because you know, whatnot takes a chunk of money, and so a lot of times we as sellers, oh, do you see them? Oh, you missed them. They just ran by. Um, have to either eat the difference or raise the money to make up that difference. And I don't like doing that. Um, and also because whatnot has like a time limit, like you have to ship within 24 hours. And sometimes it's hard for me to do. It's hard for me to find times to do shows and then to ship on top of that is difficult. But so what I did last time is I just do the show and then kind of factor in time into the night so that I can just go ship immediately after the show. But it's hard to find time to do that. Look at the filigree work on this one. This is pretty. Ooh, dang, what is with my butterfingers, y'all? Take the nails off and I can't even hold anything anymore. Rose Hot's back again. How are you? This is like a touch over seven. And I can't remember if these are topaz or appetite. They look like topaz to me, though. Three stones. I'm always going to say this, but I'm attracted to three stones because of my three boys. But it could be a past, present, future one. It could be like symbolic of your religion, like the um, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit kind of thing let's do we'll do just a 25 on this one 25 on this and let me show you what it looks like on it's an ace pretty asymmetrical ring anyhow i i've enjoyed whatnot so far i like to buy from it more than i like to do sales on it to be honest okay we are, we are at the bottom here, y'all. We've got three pieces left, and that's going to be it for, for this one. And Bonnie, I'll figure all that out. <laughs> I'll figure the price of that ring out after the show. All right, we've got... Oh, my hoops. What are you? Shoot, I don't remember this at all, and I don't know what it is. It's probably a green tourmaline. They didn't send me an invoice with my package. I have to go on the computer look it up it maybe it's a peridot it just looks really well i see inclusions okay it's probably a peridot peridot and probably cz flashlight again it's because i feel like it's showing a little dark look at that beautiful I like those prongs. Those pr I didn't realize they had prongs like that. That's different. I like that. Little halo of CZs there. Dang, this thing is so freaking sparkly, like, to my eye. I don't think it's really showing on the camera like it is to me. But that one is pretty. Let's do 20 on this one. That's a big piece of hair, though. This one's a size 6. So it should fit on that finger. Always a little stubborn. I guess we'll put it on the pinky. So you can see. 
Oh, Opal is 25. Okay, cool. All right. So there that guy goes. I believe you, Bonnie. I'll double check. But if you're confident with that, I'll just take your word for it because I trust you. But I can double check after the show. It's no big deal. All right. And then we've got, oh, man, Neon Blue. Ugh. Neon Blue Avatar, you guys. This one is vibrant as vibrant can be. This is all in your taste. What do you like better? And I'll show you really quick. God, it's so saturated. Let me show you the difference. This is Bonnie's ring. This, I think, is probably my favorite color. All right. So this one's Bonnie's. This is another version of it that's a little more pale. The blue, we're talking about blue appetite here. So see what I'm saying? It gets a little darker on Bonnie's. It's a little difficult to tell, but hers is more saturated. And then this one is like ultra saturated. And my camera's not showing it right. Teals are difficult for cameras. I don't know why. But it's like, it's dark. It's saturated. It's pretty. It's closer. It's more like a, not like a navy blue. It's like a blueberry blue. I guess it's somewhat showing up okay on my camera. And it's pretty. So I think those are CZs again on the sides. This is the last one. Now I've got one more after this. One more opal ring after this one. This is a smaller one though. Let's see. This is a, I totally lied. It's a size eight. Gorgeous. Let's do 30 on this one. Stop it. Just stop. But I won't. This one's very comfy. Why are you so comfortable? It's very like smooth under there. I guess because there's no prongs coming up to the side. It's kind of smoothed out there. I don't know. It's like it's very surprisingly comfortable. I like that one. All right, so 30 for that. I already forget the size. I know I just showed you, but... Oh, what did we say? It was an 8, right? I thought it was smaller, but I was wrong. Yeah. About a size 8. For 30. All right, last one, you guys. Last one. Okay, I will, Bonnie. Thank you. And I, for the record, I have no idea when my next show is going to be, or if I'll even have one anytime soon i do i was gonna do one with terry either this upcoming monday not tonight obviously but next monday or the monday after but um i'm not even 100 on that it's just so hard with my schedule to like figure stuff out all right here we go here's the last one another cz one pear cut faceted ethiopian opal this one is right at a seven. We're going to call it a snug seven. Okay. It's almost there. But it's like six and seven eighths. I don't know. <laughs> if I was actually measuring it. This one is fun. It's kind of got like a fun little wave detail there. And the little stones go down and then come up and swirl around your finger. I'll show you it on the hand in a second, but I just wanted to show you the. Wow. Oh, where's the, can you guys see all that red in there? Ooh, that's pretty. Hope you can see it. That's a pretty one. The black opal one at 30, nice. Was that this one, the double rose? This one? All right, hold on, pause, pause on that one. Let me know, Darcy, if this is... I guess that must be it. That's the only black opal ring I have. Nice, clean. That one is gorgeous. All right. Make sure I have your info. Jewelry ETC channel. At gmail.com. But you don't want the earrings, correct? You just want the ring. Let me know if that's right. Okay, cool. Make sure I get your info to pretty please with sugar on top. Or whatever your preference is. Stevia on top. Okay. 
Thank you. Thank you so much. That's pretty too. All right, here is, oh man. All right, here's that one. I wish you not to see such ugly hands displaying it, but man, it's pretty. Four stones. It looks like a mama and three babies. Of course, I would see it that way. If you wanted to wear it that way, or if you wanted to flip it. So the larger stone is facing you. Look at the, the inside of this feels really smooth too. I'm just inspecting it. Sorry, you guys. That is pretty. Did we give a price on this? I don't remember. I don't know if we did or not. We'll do 30 on this one as well. How about that? 30 on that one too. And that's everything, y'all. That's the whole shebangy. Awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you, Darcy and Bonnie. I appreciate your purchases. I don't know when I'll be back, but uh, I appreciate you guys hanging out with me during this video. And um, yeah, just, I don't know. Keep enjoying life. I don't know what to say. Hopefully I'll be back here. It's not this week, next week to do a sale with Terry, but I will be, I mean, this stuff will probably be what's up for sale, maybe with some, some extras there too. But uh, yeah, that's going to be it for today. So hit the thumbs up on your way out, y'all. I appreciate y'all hanging out with me. And I hope you guys have a lovely week for sure. Thank you, Bonnie. She says stay safe and hugs. Same back to you, Bonnie, and to everybody watching. Subscribe if you haven't. Hit the thumbs up. I'll see y'all later. Bye.